The Northern Heat Youth Baseball Program has had a pretty good track record of sending some of its younger divisions to both regionals and the World Series. But this year, its 13 and under team made history, being the oldest team to rep Bemidji at the World Series. Our goal is to make it in one state, and then it just happened that we won regionals. It just felt really good. They'll be taking that good feeling down to Mountain Home, Arkansas to play in the Babe Ruth World Series, an achievement that this group also accomplished as 10-year-olds. That was really crazy, and like I did not think we could at all have a chance when we were like 10. And was, yeah, that was really fun. They want to do well at this World Series. They have that experience to make the plays. They're not afraid of anybody. When, when they go up against teams, they're ready to play. The team's defense and pitching carried them in the regional tournament, ending the weekend with 14 straight shutout innings. Defense is our key, and our hitting follows up with the defense. We're usually known for hitting, but like in the regional tournament and our state tournament, we didn't hit very good, and our defense and pitching was really good. They have a staff of six pitchers that they can use, which is important given pitch count limits. That's why it takes a total team effort, and we've preached team to this, this group of boys since they were nine years old, and they truly buy into that, and it is a team concept. There's uh, no one player that's any more important than the next, and we, they all play their role and do their role really, really well. And that team mentality pays off both on and off the diamond. We're all teammates, like nobody gets down on one another. We all just work together really well and we all like each other and respect each other and then we just work together good. The team begins play Thursday night against the host. You can watch all of their games. Those will be streaming on Facebook. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.